welcome back to Game Changers, coming to you from the Battelle studio at WOSU at COSI. Venturi Automobiles is known for its innovative, high-performance vehicles, and Gildo Pastor has been the driving force of that endeavor. And you have a new venture coming right here to Columbus, Ohio. Why don't you tell us what's going to be happening? Well, we're going to be supporting, uh, again, you know, the, the speed record program, the Venturi Buckeye mm -hmm. Bullet. So that's something we want to keep on doing. And uh, also, we are here to develop cars and sexy cars because uh, <laughs> it's very important. I mean, electric vehicle got mm -hmm. to be more sexy than the other cars <laughs> they need to sell. We're creating, uh, you know, an, an American car manufacturer. It's, wow. it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a big project and uh, it starts here. and. Uh, uh, we are building a team which is going to, you know, manage the development of the company. I'm very happy to invest here, uh, and I, I really trust that to be a success. So you're bringing Venturi North America here to Columbus? Yeah, right yeah. now. We, it's our U.S. premiere, and today it's officially launched. It's going to take, you know, a few months for the things to grow here, and we have uh, uh, technology to bring and, and partnership to build. Uh, we have also, uh, you know, vehicle to, to design and engineer here. So it's a lot of a uh, lot of things, a lot of a uh, lot of effort, a lot of investment that are going to be uh, done by us here. Mm -hmm. We are doing exactly that in Europe, uh, very successfully. We're considering ourselves like a startup company. Uh, mm -hmm. we, we need to grow very fast, mm -hmm. and we will. And uh, and we have the right uh, ecosystem, uh, if you can use that word, uh, uh, to do that here. Um, you know, really experienced uh, uh, student, uh, very experienced partners. Uh, and um, we're here for that. It's been a kind of a whirlwind. You've been talking with the governor and talking about what this is going to mean for the area. And yeah, well, yes, to be visited by uh, the governor was, uh, you know, really, really fantastic for us. Um, as well, the president of uh, OSU was there. Mm -hmm. And um, there was a lot of attention on, for sure, the program, which is the Buckeye Bullet, but also, you know, the image and, and the job that could be created by the the production here. This is an exciting time kind of for this industry. Tell us a little bit more about car technologies and, and what it is exactly that, that you do. Well, we're a little over a year old mm -hmm. and our mission is to commercial vehi commercialize vehicle electrification technologies that have been developed at OSU CAR. Uh, we're entering the industry to test with a, a test lab to test the propulsion batteries that are at the heart of these electric vehicles and the most expensive component, <laughs> I might add, of these uh, electric vehicles. And then uh, after you know we've established ourselves as a premier test house, we will be moving into higher up the food chain, if you will, uh, into battery management systems, which again mm. are a core technology you know, inside of these electric vehicles and a lot of the algorithms and the software that goes inside of them. In fact, we've already had some discussions with Venturi <laughs> on exactly these topics. And, and so this is really, we've got thought here, we have the parts, and then we have the development. Yes, and I think uh, that there has been an environment that has fostered the growth of these activities. Uh, of course, the Center for Automotive Research has been involved in doing research and educational programs in this area for many time, about 20 years, for a long time, about 20 years now. Mm -hmm. But in addition to that, uh, we have uh, taken advantage of the facilities of the uh, incubator and uh, um, research park space uh, between Tech Columbus and SciTech on the west side of campus. We've also been the beneficiaries uh, uh, of um, uh, very focused funding from the Th Ohio Third Frontier program that has given us at the university the opportunity to strike partnerships uh, with uh, uh, companies in the private sector uh, to help them grow, and that of course helps us grow as well. So I think Gildo earlier used the word uh, ecosystem. I think that's exactly what has, was happening here. We are creating <coughs> a cluster of uh, uh, activities ranging from fundamental to applied research to commercialization <coughs> focused on electric vehicle mm -hmm. and technologies related to electric vehicles. Yeah, I, I wanted to tell you how much what you're doing is different from what I've seen in other places. Yeah. You know, if you take, uh, if I tell students, engineering students uh, in, in France that, you know, such things is happening and, and it's, uh, the students are so close to real life and jobs and, and they're like, you know, working on the speed record vehicle or, or you know, even production vehicle, mm -hmm. uh, this is not really, a normal situation for us. So <laughs> when I've discovered, you know, all what you were doing and and the level also of relation you have with the large car manufacturer and the job you're doing for them and the facility you have to test batteries and 
we, we have program going on and wow. that's that's really that's really a chance for us and uh, you will see a tremendous acceleration uh, in the introduction of alternative fuel vehicles of all kinds mm -hmm. and electric vehicles in particular and uh, not only in Europe uh, and in the US but uh, China is uh, coming on very strong mm -hmm. in this uh, in this <coughs> may have to absolutely yeah. And don't forget to mention, you know, there are other players besides OSU and right. Columbus. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you if you step back and you, what, I forget how big that the innovation hub size is, but I think right. if you go on about a five mile radius from the Center for Automotive Research, you hit Edison Welding Institute, you hit Battelle, yeah. you hit <laughs> the Tech Ohio, Columbus, the Ohio Supercomputing Center, Ohio Super Tech Computing Columbus, Center, yeah. the Ohio Manufacturing Institute. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> that's probably Palmer, Ohio. <laughs> that's probably all within one mile radius of, uh, yeah. right. of you know the right. center. So, so we're just in the right place. Yeah, I and um, I don't know how to call that in English, but the chef d'orchestre, uh, Giorgio. When you know you have a technical problem and you say, okay, mm. we need that very precise welding system. We have it. Yeah. It's like you know. <laughs> we know the guy. Okay, <laughs> we have that. We have that, and and no, that's that's really one of a kind. Well, we're pleased to have you, and I'm I'm interested to see what goes on with Venturi and as as this grows. Thank you so much, Giorgio. Thank, thank you, you. very much, Ken, and thank you, Gilda, for being with much. us today. If you are interested in finding out more about the Center for Automotive Research, you can visit car.osu.edu. For the entire crew here at WOSU and The Ohio State University, I'm Brittany Westbrook. We'll see you next time with more stories of innovation right here on Game Changers. Mm -hmm.